So protein shakes are really amazing. If anyone ever tells you differently, they're just being silly. But there's one reason why if I was actually trying to lose weight, I actually wouldn't be starting with a protein shake, which is crazy to think because when I first started trying to lift weights, I wanted to lose fat, I wanted to build muscle. I just thought the thing that you did was to start drinking a protein shake. And the reality is, is there's this kind of myth that this is like a super healthy food. Now, don't get me wrong. Like I said, they're really powerful, especially if convenience is an issue for you and you're struggling to hit your protein goal. But the number one tip that I would give you if you're trying to lose weight is to not be drinking a protein shake, at least as your first go-to. Because what are we inherently trying to do when we're trying to lose weight? We've got to reduce our consumption a little bit. So therefore, in order to do that, we want to feel more full. You've got to increase your satiety, increase your feeling of fullness so that you can eat less than your body actually needs to burn fat. And for how powerful and awesome protein shakes are, I mean, this is, this is a processed food. I mean, most people don't think about it, but if you're getting something that's chocolate, vanilla, cookies and cream, one of the best flavors I ever had was a cinnamon bun. When you're getting something like that, it's definitely been processed and you're also drinking it. So those are two reasons why these aren't gonna be as filling as if you were to grab something like a ground turkey. Ooh, I almost spilled it. <laughs> ground chicken, chicken, chicken thighs, fish, I mean, ground meat, steak, all those types of things. That chewing, actually helps your body to, it helps to boost that signal of satiety when you're actually chewing versus just drinking something. But I can almost guarantee that if you just make it your focus, your goal to hit your protein targets, again, your protein target being your lean, your ideal body weight in grams of protein. So if ideally I wanna be 150 pounds, I'm gonna eat 150 grams of protein. So you make that goal, of getting 150 grams of protein from all whole food sources, you're gonna struggle probably to actually do that. And you're gonna be so focused on including more things to eat that are whole food sources of protein, you're gonna be less worried about eating all of the other things. Now that actually is one reason why I would include a protein shake, even if you were trying to lose weight, and that's if you're trying to hit that goal of your protein target and you don't do it, you fall short of it by the end of the night. Now is a great time to include a protein shake because I'm less worried about you being you know, feeling full, I'm less worried about your satiety because now it's the end of the night. And these are gonna be fairly easy to digest for the most part, and so it's not gonna affect your sleep. So at the end of the night, make sure you're hitting that protein and grab a protein shake and drink that up, have something sweet at the end of the night. But if you wanna be able to hit your weight loss goal, there's actually one thing that you can do that will make your the protein tip a thousand times more powerful, and it's right up in this video over here. And as always, go get strong, but first just go give your kids a hug like I'm about to do because they're right over there in the other room. Because I think that family matters more, and I will see you over there on the next video.